Welcome to this video series and I'm excited to talk to you today about Fiverr and I'm going to provide you with tips so that hopefully you can earn a full-time living by selling services on Fiverr. There are people that are making six figures on Fiverr. Of course, I'm not going to guarantee any results. I don't know what your skills are and I don't know what your work ethic is. So I cannot guarantee anything here and just like anything, just like in life, in business, this requires some hard work. In the following videos, I'm going to talk about what is Fiverr. For those of you who are not familiar with Fiverr, how you can use Fiverr for lead generation, how to get more exposure to your gigs, uh, the importance of becoming a level one, two, and top rated seller, and why you'd want to become a pro rated seller on Fiverr. I'm also going to touch on arbitrage. I'm going to tell you what the top gigs are. And finally, in my conclusion, I'm going to tell you what I think are the keys to success on Fiverr. So come join me and I'll see you in the next video. So what is Fiverr? Well, it's a site where you can go to outsource a lot of things. But what makes Fiverr different from other freelance websites is that you can offer all types of services on here if you're looking to make money on Fiverr. For example, aside from just offering technical services such as programming and website building, you could also offer services such as impersonating celebrities and doing pranks to just drawing cartoons. Here, let's take a look at some of the categories on here. So you have graphics and design, digital marketing, writing and translation, video and animation, music and audio, programming and tech, business, lifestyle. Let's take a look at music and audio. So just taking a look here, there's voiceovers, uh, mixing and mastering, jingles and drops. Now, if you're not talented musically, let's just go back here. Uh, let's go to the lifestyles category. Just to show you that you don't really need any talent or skills. I mean, there's something here for everybody. If you're looking to make money, you can provide a service on here that doesn't really require much skill. So there's relationship, relationship advice, arts and crafts, uh, astrology and reading, spiritual and healing, reading cards, collectibles, family, celebrity impersonators, gaming. Okay, so let's say you're into gaming. So let's just click on this. Okay, so there's people offering coaching services, help you out with your gaming. Let's go to family. Okay, so there's people offering to uh, research your genealogy and your family tree. Uh, someone here is offering to guest post in their baby and mom blog. And, we'll, and someone here is offering 187 English worksheets for three to five year old kids. And now what's interesting about this is that they probably already have these prepared and it's just being automatically delivered to their customers. So not much work is required for this one. They're just basically selling uh, a product. And here's a, someone uh, offering to transcribe your histor historical documents. Okay, let's go back. Um, there's someone offering online lessons such as guitar lessons. Uh, let's go here. Last one your message on so you could just write a message let's take a look here I will be your female model for your product or brand and here's someone's uh, offering to write your name or logo on four coffee cups and someone offering to hold a sign with your message or logo and here's someone offering to deliver a message as a boatman okay so you probably get the idea there is a wide variety of services that you can offer on Fiverr. Another interesting thing about Fiverr is that when it first opened to the public, the services on here were $5. Basically, you were offering $5 services. And now you could charge more than $5, even the hundreds and I think even thousands of dollars. And what's great about Fiverr is that there are now people earning six figures a year selling on Fiverr. Most people who are selling services on Fiverr look at Fiverr as a way to make money. Okay, but there are very few people who are using Fiverr for lead generation purposes. You may have heard 
of the phrase the monies in the list so basically if you build a list of customers you'll be able to market to them time and time again repeatedly and also build a relationship with them in the process so one way you can look at Fiverr is like a tripwire you basically sell a small service or product for five dollars six or seven dollars and then you could always offer bigger services or even higher priced products later on but get them to opt in to your list after they buy your product offer them a bonus it could be anything such as a free report or you could just direct them to a page where they, they could fill in their email address so that they could be notified of any new services by you in the future one of the keys to getting more exposure to your gigs is by optimizing them the more specific you can make your gigs the better make sure to include relevant keywords in your profile title and tags you can also check your competitors gigs to get ideas now as for your cover photo the picture that's displayed on your gig you got to look at it as a thumbnail that's used on YouTube videos I'm sure you've if you've ever been on YouTube you've seen thumbnails on there that just makes you want to click so that's how powerful cover photos are for your gigs they're just as powerful as a YouTube thumbnail it'll have a major influence on whether or not people will click on your gig your cover photo could showcase your expertise. You could also, again, take a look at the top seller's cover photos so you can get ideas. Now, one thing you wanna make consider instead of just including a cover photo is to add a video. Gigs with videos actually rank better than gigs without videos. And adding a video presentation will also persuade people better than a photo. And don't worry, you don't have to be in the video or you don't even have to make the video you can just hire someone on Fiverr to speak on your behalf or to create a whiteboard video for you one of the things you want to strive for is to become a top rated seller on Fiverr and the reason for this is because your gigs will get pushed up to the top of the search engine rankings when you're a top rated seller your gigs will just get found by more people on Fiverr. So when you first start out, you're considered a regular seller. You can go to fiverr.com slash levels and you could see uh, the overview and the benefits and also the requirements for each level. So you start out as a seller and after 60 days, if you meet the requirements, you can become a level one seller and you'll get more benefits. Uh, one of the benefits of becoming a level one seller is that you'll be eligible to be featured on promotional listings. Now, after another 60 days, you, if you qualify, you can become a level two seller. And the key benefit I like about becoming a level two seller is that you'll be able to send custom offers up to $10,000. As a level one seller, you can only send custom offers up to five thousand dollars and same with being a regular seller and then finally you can become a top rated seller after another 60 days and you'll get more benefits and the key benefit is that you're like i said earlier uh, your gigs will show up higher in the search engine rankings on fiverr in the previous video i talked about the importance of upgrading your seller status from just a regular seller to a level one, a level two, and then a top rated seller. But I didn't mention another level that you could become. And basically this is a relatively new area of Fiverr. And what I'm talking about is Fiverr Pro. So here I am on the home page of Fiverr and there's a link up here where it says Fiverr Pro. You click on that and basically when you click on this, you'll be brought to a page where you can find gigs by top sellers but these are not just top sellers these are Fiverr Pro verified sellers this is basically the the top one percent of sellers on Fiverr and if you're a pro verified seller the benefits of that are for one thing you're gonna get a lot of work 
coming your way because a lot of companies are looking for high quality services and your gigs aren't just going to be found on this page your gigs will also be found on the regular listings and basically your gigs are more likely to be found than by other sellers who are not pro verified another benefit of becoming a pro seller is the credibility you'll also be able to charge a lot more money you're going to be attracting clients who aren't so price sensitive they're, they're more worried about the quality of the work than the price and are willing to spend thousands of dollars on your services i mean just take a look at some of the services here just look at the prices of some of them uh 1197 dollars for a logo six thousand dollars and this is for a brand identity for your business okay eight hundred dollars uh, let's keep scrolling down here okay someone's offering to write a travel article and this one's for 493 dollars so long gone are the days where fiverr was just about finding services for five dollars or five dollar gigs now they're thousand dollar gigs here's one for six thousand dollars i will produce an overhead video for your product another benefit of becoming a pro seller is that you'll be assigned your own personal success manager to help grow your business but yeah the people who are trying to be hiring you for your services they're not really going to be worried about the price so you don't have to worry about trying to offer a discount or trying to offer a low price to attract customers so you can focus more on quality and that's what the customers here want they want quality over price so how do you become a Fiverr Pro seller well it doesn't happen automatically unlike becoming a level one or a level two seller you actually have to apply to become a pro seller and you have to go through a vetting process so unfortunately there's only a small percentage of people that become a pro seller but it's definitely something you want to strive for if you want to grow your business and have work coming your way now this is going to be a very quick video i'm just going to quickly mention a business model that you may be interested in and it's basically a quick way to make money on fiverr this may give you some ideas some people are doing this and what i'm talking about is arbitrage so when it comes to fiverr you could sell services to clients and instead of you doing the work you're going to pay someone else from a different freelance site or possibly maybe even on fiverr uh, to do that service for you so for example um, you could go to uh, another freelance site find somebody to do logo designs for one dollar and then you could offer gigs on fiverr for logo creation for five dollars so basically you're making a profit of four dollars less fees another example is seo you could provide an seo service you could go to an seo freelance site such as seoclerks.com and they have a lot of cheap services here related to seo and you could provide similar services on fiverr for a much higher price so for example the first thing I see here is rank first on Google with massive authority edgy backlinks and this is $15. You could offer a similar service for $20 or $25 on Fiverr and when you get orders you would just go ahead and place an order from this freelancer. So this is something for you to think about. I imagine the type of person that would be interested in this business model is someone that doesn't have the time to provide services on Fiverr and would like a quick way to provide services to clients. What you could also do is ask some of these freelancers if they could give you a discount because some of them are willing to give a two for one deal and if you work with them over a long period of time you're going to get better deals. Now here are some of the top gigs on Fiverr. SEO services, mobile app development, website building, video marketing, uh, logo designs and for logo designs you don't really need special skills to do this you just need the right software there's also flyers and brochures you could create that just using Adobe Illustrator business cards and stationery Photoshop editing infographics design for this you can use free tools such as Canva just go to canva.com 
You could also provide services in which you offer to do vector tracing. And this only requires a few minutes of your time. And you just need Adobe Illustrator for this. Another top gig is domain research, resumes and cover letters. I know of somebody who's actually making a good living just writing resumes and cover letters on Fiverr. And to start off with, you could just use templates. Another top gig is proofreading and editing, articles and blog posts, voiceovers, singers and songwriters, converting files. This is easy to do. There are a lot of free tools available for you to convert files such as Word into PDF. Whiteboard and animated explainer videos. And there's a lot of tools in the market such as Explainio to create whiteboard videos. Intros and outros for videos. Uh, logo animation. And for this, you just need Adobe After Effects. There's lyric and music videos. Maybe you could offer to become a virtual assistant for somebody or you could do data entry. And last but not least, you could offer to put someone's message or a company's message on anywhere they would like, such as your body, or your car, a sign, a t-shirt, etc. I hope you've enjoyed the training and I also hope that you're ready to put in some hard work because when you first start out on Fiverr, it's not gonna be easy you're going to have to be persistent. I believe persistence is the key on Fiverr. Because when you first start out on Fiverr, you're basically starting out from the bottom and you can't just start charging $100 or more for your services. You first have to build a reputation and a great feedback score and also build yourself up as a seller. So you're going to have to start with low price gigs from five to $10 or more and expect to work long hours. There's going to be days where you're going to be working more than 15 hours. To build your reputation and your feedback score, strive for great customer service. And even though you're starting out with low price gigs, you can still make good money with the upsell. So try to provide as many upsells as you can.